Hey, welcome to Scarview Channel once again. My name is Chris. Um, right now, we're going to be reviewing a very, very great, very good EP that we just bought recently. It's on Do the Dog Records and it's uh, the John Player Specials, uh, their identification EP. It's a five track little mini album. Not really an EP, I call them mini albums. Anything over four tracks, in my opinion, is a mini album. Anyway, um, I really like this. Um, it's really cool. Um, the five songs on here are very well written and really hooky, and they you know really get me get me going. And I've been listening to this um, album in the car since I got it. I had it for a week now. I've been giving you know, giving it a good couple of listens, and wow, I mean it's really 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 good. Um, and yet another really brilliant release on Do The Dog Records. Do The Dog Records is killing it in the UK at the moment. Um, in this album, there's no exception. Um, the first track, Knock It On Wood, is great. Kicks off the Norseman Trombone solo. It's just Norseman Trombone, Nick the Ghostly with the thing. It's very good. Um, the Future of Tomorrow is really cool. Um, and then track three is called Bad Town. It's not an Operation Ivy cover, I hasten to add. It's um, a fast two-tone song. Uh, it's really good, but uh, very, very good indeed. And the title track, Identification, is also very good. And uh, track five, Written in Stone, is very good also. Um, they don't have like a horn section, they have like, one trombone player. But the trombone player is really good. and. Um, the style of music is it really works. I really enjoy this album, it's really good. Um, the back of it reminds me of the design of the King Blues album for some reason. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, um, so yeah, um, Jimmy Moot, I don't know how you pronounce that, he's the trombone player, and he plays an awesome trombone. Um, Yeah, let's check the uh, line notes. I don't think there's much to these line notes. So I kind of, oh, just a couple of pictures there, it's kind of cool. The guys or whatever, the band. It's pretty darn cool. Um, it's a little thank you list on the, on the back of it. You can see there, you know. Uh, it's about it, really. Um, I really like this. It's got a good feeling to it. It's definitely got a British accent. It's not trying to uh, be anything, but it's not. And what it is is great. Um, it's got a good vibe to it. Um, honestly, just a good vibe. Um, it's very cool. Um, just, just a, a great little mini album. And, um, <clears throat> So uh, the one criticism I do have of it is that it's a little bit short. Um, I can't wait for an album from these guys, so I'll be waiting for that. <clears throat> um, so yeah, I'll give it um, a four and a half or five, just because it's just it was a bit too short. It finished a bit too quick for me. Um, I'm really looking forward to the album from these guys. So yeah, John plays specials on Do the Dog Records. Um, a very, very good uh, mini album. I suggest you check out their MySpace. I'll leave their link to it in the side about it. Hmm, I think it's a that way, I think. I don't know, could be wrong. Anyway, um, yeah, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And also, because I didn't do one of these yesterday, because YouTube was running site maintenance, so I didn't really bother trying to upload anything, because usually it's a bit sucky on a site maintenance thing. So I'm going to do two um, album reviews today, and I have another video planned that I may unleash it on you today as well. So, depends how I feel. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, as I said. Hope everyone's having a good day. The five people who watch my videos. Cheers.